Hello, my name is Brie and I want to share with you one of my most profitable side hustles, which is furniture flipping. So what is furniture flipping? Well, it's where you find cheaper free furniture, you do a light cleaning and restoring, and then you take nice photos and then you resell it. So I want to share with you my process and in the end, I'll reveal how much money I made. So you might be asking, where do you find this free furniture? Um, well, this one I found late on a Sunday night browsing Facebook Marketplace. This guy had it posted for free and he lived about 25 minutes away. And it was really bad photos, but I could see like a table and chairs and then like four bar stools. So three of the bar stools are what really caught my eye because they were made of like rattan on the back and then they were the cantilever style, which is very trending right now. So I didn't want to miss out, so I got up very early the next morning and went to go grab them. So I wanted to share with you my amazing find. There was the tent with all the furniture, just like he said. I was so excited. It looked in great shape. The real trick was going to be able to fit it all in my van by myself. I've learned how to lift properly so I don't hurt myself. And I absolutely love my van because I can put all the seats down and it's basically like a covered truck. I've hauled so much stuff and it all fit. Hey, if you're enjoying this, I would love it if you would give it a like and subscribe. I got everything home and after looking at it in the daylight, I noticed the table was a little bit dirty and maybe a little rougher, but the bar stools were in excellent shape. I was so pleased. I gave the patio set a quick cleaning and that's all really it needed. The bar stools needed the rattan fixed. Now I just kind of put it back on and stapled it. I normally wouldn't have done that but it had already had staples where someone else had done it, so it didn't really matter. So that was just kind of a really quick fix. There was a lot of loose screws. I made sure everything was nice and solid. Then I have this stain, which is like a teak color that matched perfectly. And I just went through and touched up any scuffs and maybe like the rattans binding wherever it was kind of messed up there. I just fixed it up and made it look like new. Now here is a special trick I have for the seats. If you take them off and use these slip covers, they're 10 bucks for pack of four. They're awesome. They're waterproof, stain resistant, and I don't have to reupholster. Then I screw it back on through the fabric that way it doesn't slip off and it stays in place and then it looks like a brand new reupholstered seat for a little effort and a little money. All right, so here's the big reveal. How much money did I make? Well, the patio table and chairs were not in the best of shape. So after giving it a little cleaning, I decided just to throw up my yard and put a sign for 150 on it and it sold in three hours. That was like the fastest flip I've ever done. And the leather bar stool was also not in great shape. It was literally just like wanted to get rid of it. So I put it on my porch as a pickup. It sold quick for 10 bucks. Um, but the cantilever chairs, I had put a little more effort in them and I really wanted 350 for them. I had a lot of offers, but I just really wanted to get close to asking. So I stored these in my attic in the garage for about three weeks. And then finally, I got an offer for 300. This girl drove over an hour with her dad to come grab them for her apartment. And when she saw them, she was just as in love with them as I was. So what was the grand total? Well, I have it here written down. Um, the product, of course, was free. The gas was about $6. Seat covers were 10. And then for profit, the chairs, I made 150. The leather chair, 10. The rattan chairs, 300. So 460 was the final profit. And then subtract 16 is $444. So I also had about three hours worth of labor and drive time. So if you take 444 and divide it by three, that's 148 per hour. So there you go, it was so easy. What could you do with $444? So go out there and see what you can find. I love the fact that we're giving furniture new life and new love by a new generation. And that also it's wonderful on your wallet. So I hope you found this video helpful and interesting and I'll see you in my next one, bye.